Hello, everyone. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hello everyone, hello. How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. Welcome, Roberto. Welcome, Roberto Donai. Welcome, Diana. Welcome, Diego. It's good to see you one more time. So how was your day? How are, how are you today? I'm fine, teacher. Okay, uh, do you work today? Anyone? Or you didn't work? I didn't work. Okay, you didn't work? Okay, okay. Welcome Herbert, welcome Dina, welcome Diego. It's good to see you, welcome. How are you Herber Herbert, how are you today? My day was fine. Oh, how was your day, Herbert? What do you do today, Herbert? I work at home uh, only. Okay, thank you. Diana, how are you today, Diana? I'm good, teacher. Nice. Uh, do you, what do you do today, Diana? What do you do? Mm -hmm. Do you work? You didn't work. What do you do? Didn't work. I oh. study university. Oh, nice, nice. Good, good job. Okay, thank you, Diana. So welcome, Luis Alquimenez. Uh, welcome, Ailey. Uh, welcome, Edith. Welcome, Patricia and Monica as well. Welcome, everyone. Okay. Welcome, welcome everyone. It's good. It's very good to see you all today. Thank you for um, for coming and joining uh, this class. And as you know, today is Thursday. That means that today is the last day of this week. Yeah. So tomorrow, remember, tomorrow there is no class tomorrow, right? Tomorrow is going to be your free day so that you can go to sleep earlier or to go to any party, etc. All right. Welcome, Amilcar. Welcome, welcome. Okay, so welcome one more time. Welcome. Okay, yeah, I can see Roberto de Pauli celebrating. Okay. <laughs> yes. Okay, so um, in the meantime, I hope your classmen can join us um, later. I hope they can join us. In the meantime, uh, let me ask uh, Michelle, how are you today, Michelle? Ailey Mitchell. Well, good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome, Patricia. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Thanks. All right. Uh, for some reason, Michelle, uh, we didn't hear you. Okay, probably there might be a problem with the microphone, probably, or any problem with the computer, but that's all right. Okay, so let's go to today's topic. Okay, today's topic is the following. Let me share my screen. As I said yesterday, today we are going to what? We are going to review. Remember, I told you that. So we are going to be reviewing all the information we covered in section one and also all the information we covered in section two okay so if you have any doubt if you have any doubt or something was not clear so i hope that at the end of this class 
you are going to manage all the information that was unclear for all of you. Okay. All right. Let's go to the next slide. Okay, this is the agenda. As you know, uh, in these two weeks, we have been studying how to request, make requests, polite requests with can you, could you, would you? So we're gonna be working on that. Also, uh, we were working on how to use infinitives and gerunds, remember? For example, um, uh, for example, you can say, um, I use this computer to send emails and I use this computer for sending emails, all right? So, and also the imperatives, right? The imperatives, like for example, make sure you practice English. Uh, don't, don't, um, don't eat junk food, things like that, all right? Okay, so what's the main objective for today's lesson? At the end of this section, you will review the different topics you studied in section one, in section two. So that's the main objective for today's lesson. All right, to start, let's review uh, what we studied yesterday. Remember, yesterday we started giving suggestions, right? We were providing suggestions about cell phones, what to use, how to use it, how to use a printer, how to use a computer, how to use anything any electronic device. All right, so today to start, I'm going to ask you what, okay, imagine, imagine this is my car, okay? And I barely, um, well, I, can, I know how to drive, but I don't know well. So what suggestions can you give me? Look at the examples here. Make sure to try to be sure to don't forget to remember and others so what suggestions can you give me today since this is my car and casi no puedo manejar so what suggestions can you give me go to the chat and type the suggestions that you want me to know okay go 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 everyone mm -hmm. Okay, go to the chat. Mm -hmm. Okay, eso vimos ayer, right? That's what we studied yesterday. So to start, we are going to do that again. Mm -hmm. Okay. Edith says, make sure to review the water of your car. Good suggestion. Amilcar says, make sure to drive very well. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Make sure to put the... <laughs> okay, make sure to put the hands on the steel. On the steel, mm -hmm. on the steel wheel. Mm -hmm. Okay, what other suggestions can you give me? What other suggestions can you give me? Mm -hmm. Let me see. Vamos a ver. Oh, Patricia says, make sure, make sure to the car don't have great damages. Okay, make sure the car doesn't have great damages. Kimmy says, try to okay. get the best insurance to your car good Ailey says try not to distract yourself with with something okay yes especially if you're texting or calling your friends okay try to check the oil and water always good don't forget don't forget to fool the car the next week. Oh yeah, yeah, uh, because I'm pretty sure next week, the price is going to continue up. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Make, okay, Roberto Paul says, 
Make sure to do your homework tonight. <ríe> ok, pero Roberto, me tiene que dar un consejo acerca del carro, no acerca de tareas, ok? But that's a good example. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let me see another example. Uh -huh. Ok, about the car. Uh -huh. Let me see. Make sure to drive well. Make sure to review the water. Ok. Try to know all the car's function to enjoy it better. That's a good example. Yes, because if you don't know every single function of your car, you might not enjoy it as much as you, you would do it if you knew the functions of a car. All right, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, let's continue. Let's continue. All right, so today the warm-up activity, okay, let me see again another example. Don't forget to quit the break. <laughs> Yes, okay, that's a good example. Okay, don't forget to clean the brake hand before it starts to drive. <laughs> Try to clean your car one time a week. Make sure to close the car door. Okay, thank you. Thank you for your advice. Okay, so what are we going to do today? We are going to talk about our favorite place in El Salvador. Okay, let me see in the chat. What places in El Salvador do you know? Okay, go to the chat and tell me what <clears throat> places have you visited? What places? Mm -hmm. Okay, let me see. What places have you visited? Mm -hmm. I was visited. Mm -hmm. Let me see in the chat. Mm -hmm. What places have you visited? Mm -hmm. Let me see in the chat. Mm -hmm. Okay, my favorite play place is Puerta del Diablo. Okay. Uh, I, have, I have visited El Pital. Good. What else? My favorite place is the beach, okay? In El Salvador, right? In El Salvador. I was visit, I have visited South Korea in 2000 because I received a training there, good. Okay, I did, I have visited the beach, La Costa del Sol. My favorite place in El Salvador is the Tunco Beach. Okay, all right, what else? I visited the San Andres Rings. Archaeological place, okay. Archaeological place. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me see. I visited the San Andres Ruins. Okay, good. Okay. What? Okay. I visited the beach to Los Cobanos, Sonsonate. Okay. I okay. L listen, Patricia. When you wanna say yo he visitado, we use the pa the present perfect. I had visited, see, see, I have visited, okay. uh -huh. or you can say I was in San Francisco, okay, Francisco, mm -hmm. see, I was in San Francisco, mm -hmm. but you can say I have visited, yeah. yo he visitado, yo he visitado, all right, okay, think ah. Okay, think about okay. your favorite place and lo voy a mandar a, a, a small breakout rooms and you are going to share your favorite place with your classmates. And you need to tell why that place in El Salvador is your favorite one. Okay? ¿Estamos claro ahí? Okay, let me ask Patricia, what are we going to do Right now, Patricia, what are we going to do right now? Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm, Patricia, mm -hmm. what are we going to do right now? Uh, I don't hear very well, teacher. Oh, let me see. Uh, ¿Me escucharon todo bien o, o hay un problema de conexión? Mm -hmm. 
Hmm? No, I, 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 I can't hear you. You can't? I can't. Yes, I can hear you. Okay. I can. Okay. Yo uh, escucho entrecortado. Okay, what about now? What about now? Uh -huh. Y ahorita me escuchan bien. Ahorita me escuchan bien. Yeah, teacher, I can hear you very well. Ahorita sí. Ahorita ah, sí. Okay, the thing is like this microphone, uh, I mean, I guess it's this microphone, but it's this one as well, uh, it has a problem because sometimes it's like moving and then se escucha como cortado ahorita, right? Sí? Right? Sí, sí. Es por eso. Sí. Okay, I'll try to keep it right here. Okay. ¿Qué es lo que vamos a hacer ahorita? We are going to go to small breakout rooms and we are going to say, what is our favorite place in El Salvador? Okay, and why? For example, if you say my favorite place is El Tunco, you need to say, or you need to explain why El Tunco is your favorite place in El Salvador, okay? And if you say, for example, oh, my favorite place is Los Planes de Rendero, you need to explain why Los Planes de Rendero, it's your favorite place. Okay? Estamos claro ahí? Yes? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay, yes, teacher. teacher. Yes. Yes. Of course. Okay. Let me create the breakout rooms and please use the language. Speak English. Okay? Okay. Vamos a ver. I'll see you in the breakout rooms. Go. Okay, um, I apologize. I'm going to, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm going to create another time the breakout rooms. Uh, there was a mistake over here, but uh, no worries. Okay, Dina, vamos a esperar a sus compañeros que regresen nuevamente. Great teacher. Okay, esperemos a sus compañeros y luego vamos nuevamente a la breakout rooms. Uh -huh. Okay, Monica, hello, Monica. How are you, Monica? Monica? I'm fine, and you? I'm good, I'm good. Okay, uh, we are waiting for your classmates. They are coming to the main room, and then I'm going to send you and everyone to the breakout rooms one more time so you can practice the language, all right? Okay. Okay, so welcome. I'm very, very sorry by mistake. I pressed to give you only one minute, okay? So lo voy a enviar nuevamente, okay? Oh. I apologize, okay? My mistake. Posiblemente no practicaron nada, right? <laughs> okay, I will see you in the small break rooms, okay? Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Okay, my turn. Uh, I was busy the Santiago 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 beat. Um, for me, in my opinion, is 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 a play so good, very relaxed. You can you can you can be. No, you can be shield. Puerto de la Libertad, eh, Playas Negras, Costa del Sol. I love the beach because uh, you find something to eat in some something a uh, uh, soup cocktail. Uh, fish and the uh,
Costa del Sol, the waves, the waves are very, uh, I don't know, very gentle, I don't know, bastante suaves, no? Because I like the, the other place. Uh, okay, that's it. Uh, okay, okay, Luis. Con imágenes de Roberto Linares, para el lado izquierdo, Brisa y Damorán. Daily? Por el diablo, porque I like the, 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 weather, the weather fresh and the yeah, food and the food and the, and the views in the, in the city and the lake. Uh, Ilopango and because only that. Okay, thank you. In my case, my favorite place in El Salvador, I think it is um, Los Cobanos Beach because I love the sea and the local food is super great, super, super great. And something that is so important is the warmth of the people in there. There are so... Um, Teacher. <laughs> yes, Roberto, yes, yes. What is your favorite place in El Salvador, Roberto? Uh, my favorite place in that matter is uh, Puerto de la Libertad. Uh, Why? This is the because I I think it's very good. Uh, okay, only oh. Okay. Well, mm, what about the other ones? What about the other ones? Okay, go ahead, Patricia. Go ahead. Okay, my favorite place in El Salvador. Uh, uh, ah, Sacuarita, really? It's very beautiful there. Guayua, Ataco, Apaneca. Really? Um, wow. Really, you are, you, uh, what? really, you are a tourist in, 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 in our uh, own country. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I believe uh, our country is, is a beautiful country. estamos haciendo en grupo ahorita? Estamos diciendo que nos gusta. Yes. What, yes, yes. Uh, welcome, Susana. Um, we are talking about what our favorite place is in El Salvador. That's what we're doing now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. And by the way, uh, I'm going to give you like 30 seconds. So uh, now it could be your time, Susana, uh, to speak. I'm going to give you like 30 seconds so that we can go to the main room. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Mm, I have to talk about my favorite place in the country. Okay. Uh, in my case, I like so much uh, in the Morrison. Uh, the Okay, okay, welcome, welcome back. Welcome, Arquimedes, Diego, Diego, welcome. Uh, Diego Arturo, Roberto Donay, Azucena, Edith, welcome everyone. Okay, I hope you were talking about your favorite places. I wanna hear from you. What is your favorite place? Mm -hmm. 
Hmm? Anyone wants to share? Teacher, I have a question. Yes, go ahead, uh, Mr. Kimenez. Uh, uh, Roberto asks about uh, how do you say bañar, and I say go to swim, something like that, but I don't know if... Uh, swimming, yeah, they swimming. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, because okay. like... Like a taking Por ejemplo, a bath. Al decir, eh, ir, a un, ir a un lago a bañarse, ¿cómo oh, se dice? Or we can uh, go swimming to a place, like go swimming to a place. It could be to a river, it can be to a lake, it can go, it can be to a, the sea or the beach, or it can be to the, a lagoon, a lagoon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because, listen, there is a huge difference between taking like taking a shower, taking a bath, and swimming. We say taking a shower because we had a shower, right? La regadera, the shower. And also taking a bath is because I am a tina and probably you are taking a bath, okay? But when you go to the river, basically you go to swim, okay? Mm -hmm. Or you go swimming, okay? Okay. I hope uh, I answered okay, your thanks. question. Mm -hmm. Okay, so tell me, I want to hear about your favorite places and why. Mm -hmm. I want to hear from your favorite places. Uh, my teacher. Yeah, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. My favorite, my favorite place in El Salvador is Sujitoto. Oh. Because I was born there, okay. and uh, uh, the beach, uh, especially at Tami, mm -hmm. because um, there is a good place. Okay, thank you, Patricia. Anyone else? Thanks. Anyone else? Who wants to tell me about your favorite place in El Salvador? Remember, this is a free topic so that you can speak and talk about your experiences in those places in El Salvador. Mm -hmm. Yes, don't be shy. I, I see, I have seen that you're kind of shy today. I wonder yeah. why. Por qué andan shy hoy? Teacher. Yes, go ahead, Amilcar. Me teacher. Go, Amilcar. Okay. Go, go. Uh, uh, I believe that my favorite place in the Salvador is El Pital because it's very cool. And the, there are uh, a river very, 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 uh, very cool. Uh, and really, it's very beautiful. Thank you. Thank you so much, Amilka. Thank okay. you. Thank you. Thank you. Anyone else? Don't be shy. Azucena. Thank you, Azucena Ayala. <laughs> OK. <laughs> okay, well, in my case, I am from San Miguel and I like so much the place where there are forests uh, in, in Morazan, uh, in Perkin. <laughs> it's a place wonderful. To me, it's the best. Uh, and I would like to know El Pital. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you, Susana. Okay. Yes, I agree with you. Um, Perkin, it's a good place, a very beautiful place, but to be honest, El Pital is better, to be honest. Yeah, I'm from here, from Morazan, so El Pital is very close to me. And I mean, El Pital is good and beautiful, and I like it so much. The only thing for us that we are from this part of the country is that it's really far away from here, from Morazan. Other, other than that, El Pital is a beautiful place. Like for people who live in San Salvador or, or maybe Santa Ana or Chalatenango or Huachapan, it's very close. Mm -hmm. All right, anyone else? Anyone, another volunteer? Mm -hmm. A volunteer? Yes, my favorite, my favorite place in El Salvador is uh, El Puerto de la Libertad. Okay. Because I like that. I like the seafood, so. The food? Seafood, so. Sopa. Oh, the soup. Soup. Seafood. Soup. Seafood. Uh -huh. Seafood soup. Uh -huh. 
Oh, you yeah. like the mariscada, then? Uh -huh, la mariscada. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yes, yes. Well, me and my wife, uh, when we go to, uh, when we are around San Salvador, we go to Puerto La Libertad to get only a mariscada, me and my wife. Mm -hmm. It's very good and beautiful. I mean, the place and everything. Good, thank you. One more volunteer, okay? Un voluntario más, and then uh, we're finished. Thank you, Edith, thank you so much. Uh -huh. Okay, um, my favorite place is um, the beach, um, mm -hmm. La Libertad in Costa del Sol, because um, I like the beach and the sun, and I like uh, the view of the sea, and I like so much uh, I, I don't know, how do you say atardecer? Oh, how do you say atardecer? Can anybody know? Does anybody know? Sunset. Sun, oh, sunset. Sunset. Oh, sunset. sunset. Yes, yes. yes. sunset. Mm -hmm. <laughs> because I don't remember the, <laughs> the word, yeah. Okay. I like it so much. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for talking. I mean, okay. thank you for speaking and, 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 and sharing your ideas with your classmates. That's something that I'm looking for all the time. Uh, providing opportunities to speak so that you can feel comfortable to your classmate, comfortable to share, comfortable to use the language. All right. Today, we are going to continue uh, with our topic. As I said, today we are reviewing, uh, reviewing what? We are reviewing um, um, the topics that we covered during these two weeks, okay? Uh, this week and a half, basically. Because a week ago, we started this class. Do you remember? A week ago, last Thursday. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. So to start, remember that we were working on phrasal verbs. Do you remember that? Phrasal verbs? Yes? Yes? Do you remember phrasal verbs? What are phrasable? Phrasal verbs. A phrasal verb basically yes. is it's one verb. And, yes, and one particle. Do you remember? Do you remember? One verb, yes. like, like yes, for example, sure. big, that's the verb, and up, that's the what? That's the particle, all right? So we can say, pick up your things, okay? Pick up your things, or pick your things up. We can say that, right? And also, look at this example. With pronouns, ¿qué es un pronoun? This is a pronoun, ¿sí? This is a, a pronoun. pronoun. Yeah, un pronombre, ¿sí? This is a pronoun. Look, okay? Remember, when we have pronouns, the pronouns is, go is going to go between the verb and the, the particle. Okay, keep that in mind, okay? Every time we have a pronoun, it's going to be in the middle of the verb and the particle, okay? Not at the end, not at the end. Look, for example, no at the end, no, 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 no at the end. Sino que debe de ir en medio, okay? All right? Okay, look at this example. We have turn down, pick up, hang, gap. All right. Do you have any question about this? Any question? <clears throat> any question? No. No? no okay, good. No. All right. So these are some examples that we were covering during, this, uh, during the previous classes, right? All right. Now, let's practice. Remember, we are just reviewing. We are just reviewing. And we did that, we did this activity last week, okay? For example, pick up. What is pick up? Mm -hmm. Pick up? Recoger. 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 Okay, Recoger. what about? The book. Yeah, how about, okay, wait. Uh, how about what is? Clean up. 
What is clean up? Clean. What is clean up? Mm -hmm. Clean. Clean. Oh, clean. Okay. Put a Perfect. place. Yeah. What about Perfect. clean? Clean. Put, yeah. Clean. Put away. Yeah. What, what about put away? Mm -hmm. Put away. What about put away? Because put away. The, put away the means like guardar. Put away. Uh, yes. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. What is it? ¿Se escucha? ¿Se escucha bien? Yes, Entrecortado sure. otra vez. Okay, let me see. Uh, maybe it's the thing. Okay, I'm going to keep this like this. Okay, how about now? Better? Yes? Yes. See, sí, yes, yes. yes. Okay, good. Okay, what about take off? What is take off? Mm -hmm. What is the take cut. off? Mm -hmm. Take off. Mm -hmm. Sacar. Sacar. Oh, well, mm, no. Don't get confused between between take out and take off. Don't get confused with that. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Don't get confused with take out and take off. Okay. Take off significa quitarse. Quitarse, por ejemplo, oh, take okay. off your shirt. The, the, okay. Your boots. Your boots. boots. Your yes. Boots. Your boots. Okay. Take off means quitarse, okay? And take out take significa off. sacar. Sacar. Take out. Sacar. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Uh, what about turn down? ¿Qué significa turn down? Bajar el volumen. Bajar volumen. Bajar volumen. Yes, turn down. Okay. Ahora que ya sabemos, now that we know the meaning, I would like you to do what? I would like you to match. Okay. What things, for example, number one, it says pick up the toys. Number two, turn off. ¿Qué puedo hacer? Turn off. Mm -hmm. The music. Turn the off television. the music. The television, the, TV. the lights. Okay, listen. Vamos al chat ahorita y hágame eh, oraciones. Tal vez no oraciones, sino como por ejemplo el número cuatro puede ser. Please put the toys away. Okay. Quiero que eh, agarren solo uno. I have ten sentences. Y contesten una y me lo colocan en el chat. De los diez, select only one, please. Okay. Me seleccionan uno. Y me lo pone en el chat. ¿Ok? Yes. Is it clear? Yes, it is. Ok, go, okay. go. Yes, teacher. Ok, nice, nice. So, um, work on the, work on the, 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 choose only one exercise and type it in the chat. Vamos a ver en el chat. Ok, clean the yard up, please. Please let the cat out. Good. Continue. Les voy a dar un minuto para que las escriban todos y después los voy a leer, ¿ok? Ok, continue working. Si quieren hacer más de uno, go ahead. Se nos perdió la señal del teacher. No lo oímos, teacher. Okay, do you have a question? Let me see. Mm -hmm. Good. Good, good. Turn on the music. Turn on turn on the music. Turn the lights and the TV. Okay. Please take out the dog. Okay. Please let the cat out. Turn on the TV. Okay. Please let the cat out. Okay. Hang your jacket up. 
Okay? Please. Clean. Okay, good. Clean your boots up. Mm -hmm. Please take off your boots. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. Turn down the music. Awesome. Okay. I can see that this topic is clear. Is it clear, this topic? It's clear? Okay, let me see. Yes, teacher. Uh, yes, yes, teacher. Okay, yes, you teacher. must pick up the, yes, bar the barbage. The garbage. The garbage? Oh, the garbage, Dina. Dina Contreras, the garbage. Hang your jacket up, please. Good. Okay. Thank you, Thank teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, vamos. All right. So I want people who wants to read these parts for me. We are going to read the readings, uh, read the headings in the article. Can you think of other good advice? Necesito cuatro voluntarios que quieran leer. Four people. Mm -hmm. Me, teacher. Okay, Patricia, you are going to read this part. We all had to ask for favors. <laughs> That one, okay? okay. I read okay. the shoes. Okay. Luis Alquimenez, Luis Alquimenez is going to be choose your word. Okay. Diana, tengo, wait, entonces tengo a Patricia, a Alquimide, a Diana, y a quien más? Me. Me, you? Okay, good. Okay, so Patricia is going to read, we all had to ask for favor, okay? Uh, Archimedes okay. is going to read, choose your words carefully. And Diana, Dina, I mean Dina, Dina Contreras, Dina Contreras is going to read, be a nice person. And Adonai, and Adonai is going to read, give and take, okay? ¿Estamos ahí claro? Ok. Yes, ok. Me toca a mí, teacher. Oh, uh, din, Dina, ¿verdad? Dina, Dina. Dina. Ok, ok, ok. Eh, Dina o es Diana? ¿Quién de las dos? Me Diana es person. Oh, Diana. Oh, oh, oh. oh, entonces, ¿quién de los dos dijo? Es que no sé si me dijo Diana o Dina. ¿Quién de los dos dijo primero? O se lo pueden, you know what, para ser justos. Eh, entre los dos lo leen. Diana primero, okay. hasta, hasta donde dice you, Diana, y luego pues de ahí okay, continúa, de ahí continúa, de ahí continúa. Este por, este por. Dina, sí. Okay. Sí, sí. Okay. Okay, good. All okay. right, good, good. Thank you so much. Okay, are you ready, Patricia? Yes, teacher. Okay, one, two, three, go. Go. We all have to ask for favors sometimes, but it can be a difficult thing to do, even when Damn, you ask sense. a good friend. So how can you ask a favor? When they help you. I, when they help you. Perdón. Este, no, you continue. You continue a, reading. You continue yeah. reading. Don't worry. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. Continue. Okay. Mm -hmm. So how can you ask a favor and be reasonable, sure to get a positive response? Here are some suggestions. Thank you. Uh, a few minutes. Okay, choose your words carefully. How do people respond to requests like this one? Hey, Mike, let me your car. They probably refuse. How can you avoid this problem? Choose your words carefully. For example, say, Mike, would you mind doing me? Excuse me. Mike, would you mind doing me a favor? Mike will probably respond like this. Maybe, what do you need? Maybe, what do you need? How do you have his attention and can explain the situation? People are more likely to agree to help you 
when they know the whole story. Thank you. Um, next, uh, who is next? I guess it's Diana, right? Be a nice person. When you ask someone for a favor, you're really asking that person to go out of his or her, or her way to help you. Show the person that you're, you understand he or she is doing something especially nice for you. Thank you, thank you. Okay, Dina. Dina? Sorry, teacher. It's people <laughs> did your place, they are more likely to want to hear thems, thems sincere, sincerely when they hear you. And of, um, of course, uh, smile um, goes sorry. a long way, goes a long way. Mm -hmm. Go, I cannot, no, 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 lo visualizo, sorry. Oh, no, that's fine. Thank you. Thank you. Next. Okay. Um, okay. Adonai. Okay. Give and take. If someone agrees to do you a favor, allow the person to choose when he or she helps you. Be respectful of the other person's time and try not to ask for too much. If someone refuses your request, you should accept the answer well, politely. Don't make a habit of asking for favors and always make sure you're ready to do someone a favor in return. Reciprocate. It's just a matter of giving and taking. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. So what is this reading about? What is this reading about? ¿De qué se trata esta lectura? Anyone can tell me? ¿De qué se trata esta lectura? Uh -huh. It's about asking for help. Okay, it's about asking for help. Or favor. Okay, or favor. Uh -huh. To give a favor. Okay, a person to uh, give a favor. Advice. Uh -huh. Advice, okay, nice, nice. Okay, thank you, thank you to the ones who read the, the, the different paragraphs that we have. Uh, thank you so much. I think, um, let me check in the list of participants that I have. Okay, okay, let me see. Okay, how all of them, all of you, okay, good. Okay, if you see, I have underlined some words that I would like you to repeat after me, everyone, okay? The first one is even, 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 yeah. even. Look at this even. example, look at this sentence, it says, but it can be a difficult thing to do. Even when you ask, even. even when you ask. Uh -huh. What is even the meaning of even? Even when you ask. Mm -hmm. Even. Even. Incluso. Incluso or aún. Okay. Incluso or aún. Good. Okay. The next one is reasonably. Reasonably. Okay. Imagine que esa palabra. Okay. Imagine. Imagine que esta palabra no tiene lo último. Ably, okay. So it is a reason, verdad? Reason. Okay, repeat. Reason. 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 Okay. Reason. Now, reason. Now, reason. Now, yes. Reason. And uh, now add the word ably. Reasonably. 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 Good. Very good. Reasonably. Reasonably. Good. Reasonably. Good. Reasonably. Okay. Reasonably. Okay. Let's go to the Reasonably. other part. The other part is lend. Lend. Lend me. Lend. 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 Good. Good. Lend. 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 Okay. Lend. Ma, let's go to the next to the next word. Likely. 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 
Likely. Likely. Okay. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Thank. Thank you. Okay. Let's go to the to the next one. The the paragraphs where it says be a nice person. Okay. Let's go to that one. Okay. If you see that one is sincerely. 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 Yes, sincerely. 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 The next one is help. 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 Okay. Tenga, tenga mucho cuidado, okay. No lo voy a decir por uh, and I'm gonna mention this for for um for the one who read that one. But the thing is, debemos tener mucho cuidado de tratar de pronunciar todos los sonidos. Porque si yo, por ejemplo, dijera, un ejemplo, just an example, like that, hell, <laughs> ¿qué estoy diciendo ahí? Ajá, ¿qué estoy diciendo ahí? <laughs> infierno, infierno, ¿sí? Hell, hell. <laughs> ok, pero si yo dijera hell, estoy exagerando, estoy exagerando el sonido, ¿verdad? Hell, hell. Estoy exagerando, ajá, estoy exagerándolo. Pero si lo dijeran como más for más normal, it would be like help, 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 help. 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 Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. 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 No, I, I don't want you to feel bad. Okay. I just want you to work on your pronunciation and so that you can improve your pronunciation. Okay. Don't say, oh, no. Okay. okay? Don't take it personally. Okay. No? okay. Don't feel bad. Okay. I just, I'm trying okay. to help you to pronounce correctly or, or close to the right pronunciation, okay? Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay. Uh, respectful. 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 Yeah. respectful. 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 Be respectful. Be respectful. Mm -hmm. respectful. Okay. The Porque the time, ajá, listen, the thing is, ustedes lo pueden pronunciar como respectful, ¿sí? Y no se escucha bien, respectful. Respectful. Ajá. Respectful. ¿A dónde va la intonación? Va en la primera, res, o en pect, o en full. Respect. Respect. ¿sí? Respect. Yes, good. Respectful. respectful. Ok, next. Accept. 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 You should accept the answer. You should accept. Accept. Lo mismo. The answer. Yes. The same happens porque te puede decir accept. No es lo mismo que yo diga accept con accept. Sí. Accept. Okay. Solo tengo siete. I have. Yes. I only have seven minutes to go. Okay. Okay. Do you remember that that is very important? that we uh, we we ask for any favor or any request uh, very what very nice of course if you don't ask what if you don't ask nicely for a favor no way okay no you are not going to understand that okay or oh, it's very hard that you can get what you are requesting for example can you, can you what? Can you help me? Mm -hmm. What about the other one? Could you help me? Could you? Uh -huh. Could help you me? help me? I believe, I believe if somebody asks me like, can you help me? Is he missing? Would you mind helping me? Me voy a sentir mejor si la persona me dice, would you mind helping me? Okay. Or would you help me? Okay. So these are, remember, I told you the other day, entre can you and would you mind, what is más formal? Which one is more formal, more polite? Would you mind? 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 Okay, mind. would you mind? Good. Would you mind? Uh -huh. would you mind? When you use would you mind, when you use would you mind, what happened to the verb? ¿Qué le pasa al verbo? Would you mind? Hmm? You use ing. 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 Nice. So that would be, would you mind closing? Closing what? Closing? The door. 
Okay, yeah. closing the door. Okay. Okay. Okay, closing the door. Nice. Could you what? Could you? Could you what? Close the door. Could you close the door? Nice. What about would you? Would you? Would you close? close? Would you close the door? Awesome. Okay, thank you. Any question about this? Any question? No question? Not the chair. Okay. Not the chair. Remember, remember, every time you want to request, you need to use a polite request. Like, would you? Could you? Pero no en directo, ¿verdad? Ayúdame. Like, help me. No. If you say help me, believe me, <laughs> nobody is going to help you. Okay? Good. Next. Vamos a next. Okay. Remember that we were using what? Infinitive and gerunds, all right? And the only difference is that when we are using uh, infinitives, okay, look, for example, mm -hmm. I use my computer to send emails. And when I use for, <laughs> look, I need <coughs> ing, okay? I use my computer for sending emails. Is there any difference? No, the meaning is the same. The meaning is the same. There is no difference, okay? Okay, there is no okay. difference. Okay, nice, all right. Look, uh, for example, I use my office too. What do you need your office to? I need my office too, to what? To work. To work. To work. Mm -hmm. to work. What else? I use my to office too, to see to my clients. To. My clients. Mm -hmm. yes. My patients. Mm -hmm. I, I mm -hmm. use my office to meet my people. Meeting. I have to have meetings, see? I use my office to have meetings. Okay, good. Have meeting. Okay, what about this one? I work for, I, I, work, uh -huh. for, I work for, for, I work for, what do you work for? Secretary. No, 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 no. I work for. ¿Para qué trabaja? No en de... I work for paying my bills. <laughs> good. Excellent. I work for paying my bills. That's a good, excellent, excellent uh, example, Luis. Yeah. I work for uh, earning money. For saving money <laughs> saving money well good for you patricia in my case no <laughs> no no okay i guess um this is the last part um the last part of today's presentation um i don't know is there any question any question any question is there any question? No, no, no. no. remember that I said Everything that today we were just going to review. If something was not clear, so today we were going to review it. Okay? Is there any question? Okay. okay. No question? Okay, okay so no. I want to say thank you so much. It was great to see you and great to know you more. Thank you for coming to my class. Believe me, it makes me feel happy. All right, so I'm going to see you next Monday. You next Monday. Please, Keep next Monday, I will see you here at seven o'clock. I mean, eight o'clock. Okay. Okay. Sure. Can I talk okay. to you? Yeah, yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Okay, uh, so. Uh, when... Yes, yes. Okay. Nice. In, in the other chat, uh, Azucena, let me see, Azucena who? Azucena Rivas. Mm -hmm. She is in the classroom. No, only as Susana Ayala. Only as Susana Ayala. Mm -hmm. Okay, because she she tried to uh, she say uh, that he she's in the third model, no? 
and, and she tried to, to okay you know what to, tell her uh luis archimedes uh tell her to communicate with me later okay tell her to talk to me later uh because i know uh you need to do something else and also i need to leave because i have another group at nine o'clock waiting for me okay. right now okay so thank you so much okay i hope to see you on monday and Bye. thank you Luis Archimedes. thank you so much okay thank you everyone <laughs> bye-bye have a great night Thank bye you. Bye. 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 Bye.